now. Do it, do it. Do it now. Do it. Do it now. Do it, do it. Do it now.
There. The future is before your eyes, 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 eyes. Now, hey.
Altitude on the mix. I'm going to do uh, most of the shouts now. Don't forget, coming up, we'll have a mix from Danny Baxter as well. That's coming up in a little while. Shouts for Stuntman Magsy, John and Sean, the men that sell the juiciest rhubarb in the land, Justin and all the rest of the bowlers crew. Just shout to the hardcore turkey sausage posse. Just shout to Andy, Dave, B.A. Baraxter, Jacko. Big shout to the essential groover. You're to Russian Cara and the Blips and Blaps man, Jerome, Mr. Cigar. You're extra large Rick and Chad wins again. Thanks to everyone who rang up and uh, gave us their views on Dance Nation. Give my views when we change over from Attitude to Danny Baxter. I'll play a couple of tunes. Big shout out to Dave out there in Wigan. The XC team in Roxdale. Kev, Martin, Glyn, Phil. Janine, Johnny, Ray, Rachel and Helen and the Shelley's posse. Of course, Scott Jones in Wigan. He thought it was a good night last week. You got Gordy B, Marky B, Yvonne, Leslie, who's having a party tonight, and Dave, they agreed with me about last week. You got Paul, Craig, Pricey, Paul, and Des's mum, that's from Des. Shouts to everyone on Minsty Parade, Minsterly Parade, sorry. And at the flats, that's from Tom O'Wiven Show. It's a shout to Barry Whistle, Mark Flash, Anthony Magic, Gene Sexy Eyes, Gary Air, Governor, Zaka Pink Champagne. So that was Adele Ice Cube and Darren Terminator from Mark Mountain. Big shout to Sarah, have a buzzing night from there. Debbie, Ebby and Emma, sorry, and Sally and Oldham. It's a big shout to Paddy and Ernie. Also to Kev, going to bowlers in the Renault 5 Turbo tonight. That's from Cromie and Bolton. Up to Chris and the Posse in Wigan. The Easy E Posse, all the guys have been there. Toy, keep rushing from Kid Unknown. Bit of kick news here, DJ Tintin. Got a new uh, night style in Workhouse Promotions. The night's called Spirit at the Royal Pavilion. 24 Bank Street, Bolton, every Thursday night at 2 p.m. Two pound in, DJ Tintin. Shout to the Sequence Bossy, the Bergman Coach Bossy, the Mix Factor DJs, Wordy, Arnie, Donna, Mick, Mickey, Hobbs, that's from Paddy. Oh, sorry, big shout to Paddy. Big shout to Chink, Bagpie, Floppy, happy 18th, Quigley. For tomorrow, and uh, shout to Arthur as well. Shout to Quinny Wade, Peter. Do feed the Polecats and Johnny White, that's from Scott. Shout to the Fly Girl, Angie G. Yo to Amazon. Yo to AD and Lorraine. That's from Suicide Sonny. Big shout to all the Scousers out there, the Shelleys, Amnesia Posse. That's from the Liverpool Posse Posse, the Fallows 2 crew. The PH display team. All the different trials of bosses out there. Postcard here from uh, Cyprus. Big shout out to the ICP. After Wigan Pier, I'll be back from Leon. Apparently, I missed a shout on the 16th of May. The Dom on his birthday, sorry about that. Bit of a mix up. Keep the postcards coming if you're off on holiday. And I've got a letter here from uh, Northern Ireland. This is a letter from uh, Northern Ireland. It just says help. Six foot letters. Frequency, 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 frequency. I'm losing my grip on sanity day by day. Frequency, frequency. And I'm hoping you can get me some correspondence. Ah! I've just been sent to Ennis Skilling in Northern Ireland for six bloody months or summer. Frequency. I'm not even supposed to be out here because I'm pending on drug offences. Now this guy, Ali's a soldier out there. And he's not happy being in Northern Ireland at all. Oh, well, this guy's really desperate. He's really bored. One of our fellow ravers. Speaker. Manchester lad wants to put a shout out to the Manchester Posses and all those who got the Shelleys. He wants some letters sent to him. Flyers, anything will do. If you've got a pen and paper, take down his address. This guy needs your help. Here we go, there's a number here. The address is 24788465. Private Allen. A Company. CHQ. And 
just says one Stafford's. The most important thing is the postcode. If you get this down, BFP0813. BFP0813. Big shout out to Alan, all his crew out there in Northern Ireland. The guy needs uh, help from us, like, right to him. Like I said, Altitude on the mix. In a bit, we'll have Danny Baxter's mix. Unseated will await the next show. We filed slowly in line with the
Tune for the mix. They'll be back soon, hopefully. Look out for my flyer soon as well. There's a shout to Mick, I know a girl. Can't wait to get her legs around you, that's from simple. And a shout to Andy. You have to Adam Whitey and Banty, had a look about the toke. Shout to Speedy, Steve and Woody in Steve's bedroom. And a big shout to Geordie and all the heads at the International 2 last night. I was at the International 2 last night, superb night. It's only a shame it wasn't busier. Big shout goes out to Ribbon Quest and the Ribbon Quest dancers. Big goes out to Francine. And her crew for a top PA. Big, big shout to Zero Zero. Another stunning uh, concept of PA kind of thing. Respect to the DJs, Jay Weir, not too bad. Night was had by all. Tracks off a new 808 EP. And like I said last night, I had a good time at the International. The PAs were good, the sound was brilliant, and DJs were good. I wish we could say the same about Dance Nation last weekend. Now, I have never gone out of my way to slag anything off before. I try not to slag things off. But it's got, there's some things that need saying about last week. I was taking some calls and it was like 80% of the people didn't enjoy themselves last week. There were people there enjoying themselves and good luck to them. As far as I knew, the doors were supposed to open at 10 o'clock. We got there at 11.30 and we were in a queue that went, in, went on for about two miles. We had to park about 20 minutes away from the venue. We walked to the venue, got there for half 11, we joined just a massive queue. Didn't know where it was going. We were just going nowhere fast, that was the answer. And we're in the queue, what happens to us? Some sod lets off a CS gas canister behind us. Nice one, so we've been CS gas and we're not even in the place yet. And luckily this was outdoors, so the gas went up. So basically we just started to sneeze and coughed a bit. Some of the posse were quite ill though. So I had to look after one of the posse because she got it in her eyes and her throat and everything. We got in the uh, place for about 1.30 in the gaff. The first thing I noticed is just the sound in there was rubbish. That was appalling, what The sound in there was absolutely rubbish. 
I'm a DJ and I thought I knew the records there, but I had to guess where the beats were when I was dancing. Bear in mind, this is all for 20 quid. 20 quid for an all-night and it didn't start till after midnight. I went on till 7 in the morning. I just sat down, but there was too much oil on the floor to sit down. I don't know who was DJing, I couldn't tell. So when the MC started speaking, through no fault of their own, it just sounded like thunder or distortion or something. So I've already been gassed. I'm not having a particularly good time in there. I can't hear nothing. What happens next? My best mate gets ta taxed at knife point inside the place. Knife in the stomach, cans in the pocket, all his money out. Nice one. Unbeknown to me, I walk up to him. And then I get threatened as well. This happened just before four o'clock. Four o'clock, the sound went down. And it went down for a long time. Which might have been a relief in many ways. What can you say though, 20 quid? Well, minimum 20 quid. Some, uh, some shops charging 25 quid for tickets. Something that didn't start after midnight, went on till seven in the morning. Rubbish sound. It was just mayhem inside the club. People getting taxed, people getting taxed outside. Cars getting broken into. I've got to say, for the first time in my life, to be honest, I was quite glad there were coppers inside the rave. And they were glad there were coppers, loads of coppers outside, so we got them back to the car, all right. Because we were distressed, basically. So there you are. Is it, is it fair that people pay 20 quid to be treated like that? A couple of plus points where there was a good PA by Shades of Rhythm. And a lot of scouts and mags got on with each other very well indeed. And there was quite a good atmosphere. Bobby Moan. It's what he needed to say, really. It wasn't when I started, but if I just had my ticket with my mates, queued up like everyone else, and that's how we got treated. 20 odd quid, it's just not fair. And it's not on. I'm all for bringing, bringing big rays up to Manchester in the northwest. That was Bobbins, man. That's no way to treat people. Agree with that or disagree? Nine five three five thousand. Anyway, we're back to doing what we do best. Not moaning out yet, entertaining yet. We'll have a mix from Danny Baxter in just a bit.
one of the new remixes of Ultrasonic's tune. I'm in a few weeks. at 102. The tune before was Ultra Cynic. One of the remixes out soon. We're now into Danny Baxter's mix.
OK, I know it's not very loud. <laughs> Bear with us. I'll try and get it back to you in a bit, a bit louder.
Done. Problem solved. Thanks to Andy Robinson for that. We're back with Daddy's Mix. <laughs>
the sunset, the kicking of them. Almost nine o'clock, stand by for the Mad Hatter after the nine o'clock news. 
Lots of the shouts now, the shouting altitude faithful. Happy birthday to Meals on Wheels and Leo. Chinks, a silent member of the Microdot Musketeers. It's not Chinks' birthday though. Happy birthday to Sarah. And it's that Tama, Tamer, don't be late. That's from Attitude, Paul and Woolly. There's a shout to Coochie, Heating, uh, Julie, Jackie, Caroline, Cock and all at Granville's. You got Paul and Pauline. At Truffley, that's from Nick, Emotion and Ultrasonic. Nick Ossie will be at the PSV tonight. He's also supporting the Orbit Academy to go down tonight. Big shout to Claire, Martin, Stu, Tracy, all in Salford. Big shout to Ricky as well, that's from Mark Monson in Eccles. Shout to Andy Moore from Greg Scadino. Shout out to the Jersey crew. You got Peter Cragen and Paul Tweed and all the uh, Marrowheads taking it easy tonight. Thanks to our two people coming in doing the mix. Danny for doing his mix. Sorry about the technical problems before. Back same time next week, five o'clock next Saturday. Stand by for the Madata after the nine o'clock news. On 102 FM, in stereo, this is Sunset Radio, the kick-in FM. The 9 o'clock news, this is Jenny Mitchell. Sweeping sanctions against Serbia have been voted in by the United Nations in a bid to halt the fighting in Bosnia. Thirteen member states voted in favour, with only China and Zimbabwe abstaining. The trade ban includes an oil embargo. Air and sea links with Belgrade are to be cut and sporting ties severed. It means Yugoslavia will be thrown out of next month's European Football Championships. They were due to face England in the opening match. Meanwhile, Serb irregular forces have launched a fierce attack on the Bosnian capital, Sarajevo. Witnesses report machine gun fire and street fighting and say shells have been pounding down. And the Croatian port city of Dubrovnik has come under fire again. Bombs have been raining down, sending residents scurrying for shelters. India's delegate to the UN says the sanctions are welcome but may not be enough. These are important considerations for my delegation. But they do not, and I stress this, detract from our serious concern. It is what is happening in the region. And from our conviction, as stated earlier, 